Disadvantages of Prefabricated Pools Hello friends, today we will discuss about the disadvantages of prefabricated pools. Prefabricated in-ground pools, most commonly known as fiberglass pools, are fully manufactured before they ever leave the factory. Conversely, concrete structure pools are built on location from the ground up, and require a vinyl pool liner to protect swimmers from the rough concrete surface. Fiberglass pools often last 20 to 40 years, but if problems arise with the structure or coating, they are difficult to repair. Problems with leaks. Pools require a proper foundation to prevent leakage. Leaks can cause problems by saturating your yard or making it difficult to keep the recommended water level in your pool which often results in costly water bills. Settled plumbing, typically resulting from a sand backfill, is often the cause of leaks in fiberglass pools. As the sand supporting your fiberglass shell settles, shifts and erodes slightly, your sand-encased plumbing sinks and shifts with it. Damage to return lines that run from the pump and filter to the pool and compressed suction lines that recirculate water through the filter are common causes of leaks. Main drains at the bottom of a prefabricated pool might also crack as backfill shifts. If you suspect you have a leak, watch for unexplained lower water levels, wet spots near the pool that never dry and visible cracks. Battle of the Bulge Prefabricated fiberglass pools are susceptible to warping, bending and bulging when the backfill doesn't adequately support the pool. The best backfill is gravel, not sand. Gravel backfills create a solid foundation and are much less likely to settle or shift over time. Step-by-step -step points out that when a sand backfill gets wet, it expands and exerts pressure on the fiberglass shell, leaving little or no room for expansion. You should only use sand as a backfill if your natural soil is sandy. Then, the entire underground material will adjust for the saturated sand, creating an equal balance of pressure. Otherwise, opt for a crushed gravel backfill. Gravel isn't affected by water, so the pressure of the water-filled pool and the friction between gravel pieces holds the fiberglass shell securely in place. Gravel also drains much better than sand. Pools get blemishes, too. Fiberglass pools are sturdy and durable. However, top coats can peel, scratch, fade or crack over time, usually due to wear and tear or sun exposure. Multi-layer top coats are visually appealing because they have vivid aquatic colors, shimmery metallic flecks and high gloss finishes. However, multi-layer top coats are difficult to color match, refinish and repair and often require professional grade equipment, commercial paint products and industry expertise. Problems arise when pool repair specialists attempt to duplicate the original finish on a multi-layer topcoat. The underlying painted patterns, flecks and sheens have unique, individualistic characteristics that are difficult to copy. Avoid this problem by purchasing a prefabricated fiberglass pool that is only one color. It's much easier to match and blend paint colors with a solid surface finish. Watch out for spider cracks. Some prefabricated pools get cracks in their clear top coats. Even though the thin, narrow, spider-like cracks don't compromise the integrity of the pool, they make the pool look like it's fatally flawed. Thin top coat cracks can be a result of poor manufacturing, tension on the shell during shipment and aggressive or improper installation, says expert. A prefab pool that is not level can develop pressure points that cause the fiberglass shell to bend. In addition, a lopsided pool looks awkward and unappealing. The best way to avoid unsightly topcoat cracks is to do your research before you choose a manufacturer or hire an installation crew. Get recommendations from friends, neighbors, co-workers or pool specialists and read manufacturer reviews before you sign on the dotted line. You can return a damaged fiberglass pool, but reordering, reshipping and scheduling a new installation can be frustrating especially if the ground has already been excavated and you're anxious to finish the project. If you like the video give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. For getting more useful and interesting information, subscribe to the engineer Ajay Lodz channel, How to Make My House.